Separating fractions is something you're going to want to do when you're doing differentiation, uh, mainly when you have a single term in the denominator. And the reason you're going to want to do this is because it lets you derive term by term instead of having to use something like quotient rule. So for example, if you had any type of uh, rational function where the denominator is a single term. So let's take an example like this. x squared plus 4x plus 7 all over x and you were asked to take that derivative, it would be much simpler to make each term divided by x rather than do the quotient rule. So if you divided each term by x, you would just do like so. And you can do that because think about it in reverse, if you all three of these terms have a common denominator and you would be able to put these together in one fraction. So these two are really the same thing. But now each one of these can be simplified a little bit. x squared divided by x is just x. 4x over x is 4. And 7 over x, we can write as 7x to the negative 1. And you can see now, doing your derivative of this function right here, you can just do term by term using power rule, and it would be much simpler than doing quotient rule to start with. So that's why you would want to separate fractions for problems of this form.